Okay, finally you find a buyer and you get a contract and then we are negotiating the process and there's some contingencies on the contract that has to go through. They do the termite inspection, the home inspection, and uh, out of nowhere, somewhere in there, they find termites or they may find bed bugs in your house. And then they use that as a technique to be able to negotiate a lesser price for you, kind of forcing you into getting, uh, accepting a lesser price to the original contract. You know, be very careful. You know, obviously, you know, if you have termites in your house, you have to take care of it. There is no, there is no in between on that. And if you have bed bugs, obviously, you know, you need to acknowledge the fact you have bed bugs and you need to fix them before you sell them because that is gross. You don't want to sell a house with bed bugs to somebody else. But when you have to recognize sometimes, especially if you are for sale by owner, how someone can force you into dropping your price for lesser amount when they actually out of nowhere, they find some invisible termite somewhere. And uh, so you be very careful because if you suspect someone is using that technique in order for you to drop your price, you can actually counter that by hiring your own inspector, your termite inspector, and say, do the inspection and, and actually challenge those finding, findings. And the same thing with the bed bugs. You can ask an exterminator or someone who specializes on that, come over and do a, 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 a check in on your house. It's go probably going to cost you $200 for someone to do a small inspection about this. But that is a lot less than having to drop the price of your home for $3,000, $5,000 at the last minute when they know that you are already counting on the money. Don't let them push you around, making sure that when you have something like this, uh, you need the, 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 attack, the, the attack from your part will be to hire another expert to hear your case and validate the points that you do not have no termites or you do not have no bed bugs in the house. Hopefully this helps you.